Right, the youngster is a five-year-old girl who, instead of being in class yesterday, was left alone on a school bus. This is, Steve, this is intolerable. It, it, it's unacceptable. Yesterday morning, a JCPS driver dropped off students on his bus at Eisenhower Elementary in Pleasure Ridge Park. But one remained. A little girl apparently had fallen asleep in her seat. It is protocol that the driver physically get out, the, get out of their seat and walk the bus, ensuring that all of the students have been dismissed at the school. The bus returned to the Lees Lane compound in southwest Jefferson County with the child still inside. Once the bus is shut down, the driver is required to check the vehicle again for students. School system chief operations officer Mike Razor says there is proof that didn't happen because the bus camera continues to operate for 15 minutes. We had a five-year-old student who between 9.05 and 9.15 after viewing the bus camera footage, was seen to be left on the bus. Around two hours later, security cameras in the compound capture the girl walking in the compound. A few minutes later, an arriving bus driver spotted the youngster standing at the curb at Farnsley Middle School, which is on the same property as the compound. By that time, the LMPD was on the scene. The child was okay, but school officials are not. We will not tolerate when safety protocols are, are not followed. The, the, the safety and welfare of our children is our number, number one concern. Now, Mike Razor tells me for him this is personal because he puts his son on a JCPS school bus daily. As for the driver who has worked for the school system for five years, he resigned. If he had not resigned, Razor says he would have been terminated. Steve Bergen, WLKY News. All right, thank you, Steve. 70,000 students are transported on some 970 Jefferson County school buses every day.